It all comes down to this, the fifth and final game of the Midwest League Championship Series. The Whitecaps are trying to bring home their eighth league title, but they'll have to get through a tough Cedar Rapids Colonels team one more time. Larry Figurski is live at Veterans Memorial Stadium in Cedar Rapids, Iowa with a preview of the big game. Larry? Yeah, it's been eight years since they had a chance to celebrate, but the 2015 team hoping to join the five other white cap clubs who have had a chance to win Midwest League titles. And the Caps, as you can see now, literally just wrapping up with what will be win or lose their final batting practice uh, BP here of the season. Had a chance to talk with skipper Andrew Graham just a few moments ago. This game, just another elimination game. They faced four here tonight, but this one a little bit different with everything on the line. I mean, it's, it is what it is. It's the best team. Whoever plays the best today wins the whole championship in the Midwest League. I mean, uh, we've been here in Lansing before where it was a must-win game twice, and we pulled it off. So we know what it feels like. Um, we're just going to come out today and uh, play the best baseball we can. That's really been the philosophy. And the players were saying the last couple of days, there really was no fear in the clubhouse when you've been in these, you know, winner go home situations. Yeah, and that's uh, that's what I've been trying to preach these whole playoffs. Is we, if we play scared, we play with fear, you don't play your best baseball. I've been telling these guys just go out there. It's a game they've been playing since they were five, six years old. Go out there, have fun, and uh, execute. And if we execute, we'll have success. What's the confidence level of the guys now, especially you know being where they had to win yesterday? Yeah, I mean they're feeling good. They're feeling good. As I said, uh, you never know what's going to happen. Baseball was a crazy game, but uh, we got Russ Seaton going for us. He's been doing good for, great for us all year, and uh, yeah, we'll, we'll be all right. What's the message you have for these guys going into this game? Is it any different than what you've had, you know, the last seven games or whatever? You know, it's the last game of the season. The only thing I'm going to say differently is uh, if you guys are feeling tired at all, I don't want to hear that. Give me 100% <laughs> of what you've got. You know, it's the last game you guys will play. You'll have a whole offseason to recuperate, so it's time to go out there and give it all on the field. I mean, obviously, you've been in situations like this. It means a lot for guys to leave their legacy. For the guys who aren't here next year, they can be a part of the history of what's been so great here with the Caps over the uh, you know 20 years we've been Yeah, I mean, it'd be great to bring another championship back. Um, I don't think these players realize how hard it is to make it to win a championship. I mean, I know guys who played uh, 13, 18 years who've never made it to the playoffs, let alone get a chance. A lot of these guys in their first full season to go to game five of the championship series. So, you know, I'll, I've explained it to them. They're excited, and uh, we'll see how we go tonight. And it is that chance to leave a legacy and be a part of Whitecaps history that has these guys walking that fine line between excitement and pressure. And there's a little bit of both here tonight in Cedar Rapids, Iowa. Again, game time coming up 735 Eastern time. We'll have highlights for you tonight at 1011. Also coming up in sports, we'll hear from some of the players. For now live in Cedar Rapids, Iowa with the Whitecaps, it's Larry Figurski, 24-hour DC. Hey, Larry, All thank right, Larry. you. Yeah, looking forward to it. Go Whitecaps. Go Caps. Thanks, Larry.